The rain almost put a damper on a major milestone for the Albuquerque Isotopes. Tonight, the club was expecting its 5 millionth fan to pass through the gates at Isotopes Park. And as the first pitch was delayed, the Isotopes thought their celebration might be two. News 13's Amanda Goodman is live at Isotopes Park with more. Amanda? Well, Tim, it wasn't looking good early, but as game time approached, so did the lucky fan. I had no idea at all. Didn't know that this was going on or anything, so very, it's very surprising. Maya Peterson and her family were greeted by Orbit and cheers as she walked into Isotopes Park, and now their history books. As I mentioned, the rain really had the Isotopes front office wondering if they were going to hit their milestone tonight, but those fears were quickly put to rest as fans poured into the stadium for tonight's game. The general manager says on average, the Isotopes attract an average of 8,500 fans a game and have been a successful franchise since coming to Albuquerque in 2003. He thinks a lot of that has to do with the stadium. Voters approved a 25 million dollar bond to pay for the total redo of Isotopes Park before the team even came here. Now in their ninth season, the general manager says the fans have really been consistent in supporting the Isotopes and that translates into a nice boost for the city's bottom line. We employ close to 500 people between the food service operation and the team operation, so you know, it's wonderful for employment. And with the money that we give back to the city every year, basically about $2 million, uh, you know, that's, that goes right back into funding the stadium and the repairs and the maintenance and paying down the bond. And fans I spoke to say between the facility and the atmosphere, they love coming to games here. Now, as for the lucky five million fan, she gets quite a treat. A trip for two to L.A. and also two tickets to see the Isotopes Major League counterparts, the Dodgers. Tim. Thank you, Amanda. The final attendance for tonight's game was 10,489, more than they needed to pass the five million mark. Lawrence Gilligan will, of course, have highlights from tonight's game coming up in sports.